Drive Road has just updated, so let's check it out. Heading into the game and looking in the shop and going to new cars, we have no new cars like usual. But if we look in the bottom left, we can see that there's this new Halloween pumpkin here. And if we click it, you can see that there is some new cars and different customizations for our cars. And to get these, you'll have to complete missions to earn them. So if we head into the missions tab, you can see that each mission will give you a certain amount of tickets. And I believe to complete this pass, you'll have to finish all the weekly challenges and play 10 days and get all the daily challenges done. So this is definitely way harder than anything else the drive world devs have brought out. And now heading into the weekly challenges, we have two new shadow race challenges, which I'm going to do. And then 15,000 speed traps, 200,000 drive score. I'm pretty sure these challenges are twice as hard as the normal challenges because you have to get tickets for them. And they want it to be kind of hard to get this Pagani. And we have 600 boost pads, 5 parts, and 5,000 pumpkins you have to smash. Which I think this challenge is going to be actually pretty difficult. And we have two new cars, the first one being the Sideswipe X, and the second one being the Apex GTR, which I think the Apex GTR is basically just another remodel of the Apex family. I think I had some people following me. Um, okay, let's head on to the weekly challenges. For the first one, we have a new race called Runaway Roller Coasters, and I'll do that right now. I really like this race. It seems a lot like the ultimate driving race at the spawn. And for the second shadow race, we have Golden Valley Grand Prix back. And there you go, completing those two will get you 15 tickets, which is 5 tickets away from these rims and this new car. And now with that, I'll show you the 5 parts in the USA map. And as you can see, all the parts on the very left side of the map, which I guess is because it's a fall area and it's Halloween, head over to this area right here, the forest. And right in the middle of the bridge, you'll see the first part. For the second one, after you collect this part right here, you can just head down over here and you'll see the next part. For the third part, head over to this race right here, Forest Trail. And right on the road up here, you'll see the next part. And for the fourth part, you can head from this part right here. And right up here will be the next part. And for this last part, you'll want to head over to this race right here, Redwood Pass. And right over here, you'll see a maze. And if you take this path, you'll see the next part. And once you complete these three challenges, you'll be given enough to be able to unlock this car and rims. And here we are in the nighttime. You can see what this looks like. There's a huge moon behind us and it makes the entire world purple. And now I'm going to grind these other challenges so I can get all these tickets.
Okay, I have been grinding for about a half an hour, and this is how much I've completed. Uh, I completed the the speed traps. I got around half of the drive score, and barely any of the boost pads, and I wasn't grinding pumpkins, so I didn't get any of those. So now I'll collect them so we can see kind of what it looks like whenever you get these in the pass. And there we go, I have a total of 40, which is only able to get me these two first ones, and that's what it looks like once you've earned one. And then you can claim it, and that's what it looks like once it's claimed. So starting off with the new cars, the first one we have here is the coach. And here are the upgrades that are actually pretty cheap. And here are the customizations for it. And we have these new decorations on the cars you can put. And if you played during the time the other events have happened, you have seen that these accessories have gone away. So if you want these, make sure to grab them now. And I'm pretty sure these are free for everybody, so anybody can get them even if you don't have the pass. On to the second car, we have the Zeta, or the Pagani. And there's what the spoiler looks like, the customizations you can get in the pass right now. And this is how expensive the upgrades are on this car, and this one is pretty expensive. And the last one we have here is the Rotary Evo. And here are the upgrades on this car as well. I think it's a little bit more expensive than the Pagani. And here I'll show you all of the new Halloween customizations. So starting off with the first one, we have these pumpkin wheels. And the second one, we have these cursed eyeball rims, but I don't think you can get these yet. And here's what one of the new wraps looks like. This is webs from a spider. And the other one we have is this ethereal wrap, which this looks like it's glowing in the dark. And if we head out of here, and switching into nighttime again, you can see how the car is really bright. And here's the exhaust effect for it. And you can change this to any color as well. And now onto the weekly challenge cars. The first one we have here is the Sideswipe X. And the other one we have is Apex GTR.
And with that being said, I think that's going to be the end of this video. Let me know down in the comments what you think about this update. And I'm going to try and post a video of how to do all the quests later this week.